So now what I want to do is just make our success message for this join to be just a little bit better, or at least for the create view itself. I wanted to actually render some sort of success message. So what I'm going to do now is import from django.contrib.messages.views. We're going to import the success message mix in. And we're going to go ahead and add this in here. And then we'll just override the method of define get success message. And it takes in self and cleaned data. I'm going to go ahead and print out what the clean data is so you can see it. But really, I'm just going to return a message saying thank you for joining. We'll save that. And since I'm using this messages framework, which is built into Django, I can actually go on my base.html and add in something above block content. And we'll say if messages, then I'm going to go ahead and iterate through each message. We'll say and if, and then we'll do for message in messages in four. And in our case, I'll just say div class equals to alert and alert warning. Close off the div. And then we will just say the message. And I'll give a break tag in there for each other message. In fact, we will put that inside of here. There we go. So we save that, refresh, and I'll just say abc at gmail. Hit join. This already exists, so we'll do one, two. And there it goes. Thank you for joining. Okay, so that's actually giving us a little bit of a different look that we might want than we might want. So I'll just add a container inside of this message. So we'll do div class equals to container. Close that off and try that again. abc123 or whatever. Try that out. And there we go. So we've got thank you for joining. And now we have that alert working um, just fine for us. It's not necessarily the best styled alert, but it is working. Um, and it, the way it's the reason it's working this way has to do with how it's all styled, of course. Um, so that's it as far as the message is concerned. I did want to show that in particular. Now, there are other ways to render out any given message, um, but that's how I'm going to leave it. Now what I want to do is actually update how our pages are rendered out and make it a little bit more robust. If you have any questions on what we did here, let us know. Otherwise, let's keep going.